Hi, good morning. It's uh, Monday morning and the weather is clear. I woke up not so so long ago because I had a very very peaceful sleep. So I'm trying to take a walk, move around and see, you know what's 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 going on around and share with you as well yeah so currently i'm, I'm the only person here my wife had to go back to where she works yeah so i've been here alone for the past uh, i think four to five days yeah i think about four to five days yeah and yeah i've been doing my own cooking I uh, haven't done any washing yet, but I've been doing my own cooking, washing of the cells and the rest. So that's how it's been like here so far, and it's been great. Yeah. So I have some plants that I've, I've, I've planted. Normally when I wake up in the morning, I have to water them before anything else. So right after this, I'm going to water plants so I have the coconut I have mangoes I have um, I, I tried planting some pawpaw um, they, ha they haven't germinated yet so I just spread the seed across so they, they go so I have mango, pawpaw, um, pear watermelon say did i say watermelon no <laughs> um, coconuts instead and then orange so let me just fetch some water and then see there's a lot of life on on this land um, anything that falls on the soil just that look good let me just show you an example so we harvested our maize and when we we're just taking them off the the cup some just fell and they started growing so I'm done watering the plants are mango orange coconut sour sap pear and yeah i think that's all uh, and then there's also planting which is at the back growing so basically that's it i'm going to be taking a walk and just show you around what it looks like in the morning over here so i'm all set and stepping out now once you step out from the house and you come in front of the um, road that is over here there's one to the left and then to the right and then when you take the right there's a junction there so this is just the should i call it a road yeah well it is because cars ply it motorbike also do ply it and then um yeah but let me just show you around here so there's some buildings going on over here if you look at this and then down there and then there are many more that goes down there and there's also a stream so one day we we'll take a walk there but today we are going towards that side and over this side also so there's a family over there that is constructing a container housing far and i don't know if you can see it or even if you saw it in one of my drone videos so yesterday uh after church i just passed by there to say hello and to see what they're doing and it was it was, it was great it was awesome 
so yeah now this is a junction I'm talking about when you get to this junction there's uh, it should be a road to the left however it's very bushy and then this is the main one that goes back to the main road now when you take this one to the left I go down there there's a stream and then there's also a group of babu over there so that is bamboos yes the plant bamboo and then over here you'll be sometimes lucky to see cows so i don't know which way i should um go, whether i should go this way or this way to see bamboos and the stream and then or maybe to see the cattle so let me just go here there's a man that i was supposed to say hello to because i needed some of the bamboo and he's not heard from me so let me just go by there and then see if I'll meet him if not I don't if I don't meet him I'll just go see the bamboo but the last time I went to see the bamboo that was with my um, wife where the stream it's actually just underneath the stream you have the bamboos over there um, I felt a little bit creepy over there because we uh, were sitting there just having a normal conversation and I felt like the bamboos were moving it really felt creepy so we just had to leave i don't know i don't know maybe if it was moving it wasn't moving or it was just yeah because it was very quiet over there some women came to fetch water at the stream and on this particular road there's just one building going on down there uh, we get in there very soon and people have also been wondering if there's electricity around so this particular place i'm going to has electricity so i'll show you um, and like i keep saying it's about 600 to 700 meters from our place which is up there so let me just turn over and show you how the, the road looks like so as you can see very bushy yeah most of the time during the dry season they do a lot of burning because they want to farm so even around the side there are some point or portions which have been bent and the farms that you are likely to come by or see around here are mostly pineapple um, maize cassava um, a little of um, plantain yeah so i think you can get a clear view of the container house from here so that's it far away over there i think the family slept over they have like some kids uh yeah but it feels great actually living around here so very peaceful very serene uh you won't have any disturbances yeah and normally in the morning what does it feel like once you wake up so most of the time once you wake up in the morning you hear a lot of birds chirping yeah different kind of birds and sometimes when you come out you see them you know um eating or maybe just having something to eat it's 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 really really nice i must say and then um during the morning also there's a cattle that come around to graze so they come around and then you have this pelicans following them here and there so that's why you are likely to say so yeah, my son like likes that a lot so whenever he sees the cattle you know he's not learning how to talk so he just start making a sound <laughs> i taught him that actually so yeah there's some maze here so this is like maze going you can see that yeah so there's maize planted over here this is a palm um, tree a few of them down there so there's like a valley so when it rains a lot there's water that passes down there to the stream i'm talking about and this is either orange it should be orange so this is orange and you have some cassava here as well and then this is another palm and then coconut now one thing about this place is that there are so many coconuts like farms especially closer to the main road yeah because like i've seen countless of coconut trees around there i don't know if it was planted intentionally or it just grew by itself but there are so many coconuts so this is one of the buildings i was talking about here yeah i think it's about two two bedroom house yeah started not so long and they've gotten like very far so this is one of the villages that i was talking about there's electricity at this particular place this is where we wanted to tap electricity from all the way to our point but it's not been successful yet so 
let me see if I can meet uh, the man I know from this house and then if not I just continue to the stream so, I think he's there okay so maybe you know, they might not be comfortable filming so let me just film myself and then oh let me just yeah I go here, be here. Good morning. Bring up away. Good morning. Five BFA. Hmm. Then Masha. Eh, I came here to overtake me. Eh, no me be, me be around. Eh, eh, from when you came, no me be in town. Can can only my issue is a far. You call me town, you can feel friends, can feel shy. Uh, because I Oh, okay. 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 Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. No no you mean time for you when Jimmy Tama let in a to care a clear boy a fish small farm cook yes sham Ah if you can cry Eba saba. Ah, Messi. Eba saba. <laughs> so, uh, as you probably might have overheard us, we're discussing about the bamboos that I wanted. I wanted some to fence my place and then I could start some small farm over there. So, I came over to say hello to him. So, this is the place you notice there's electricity here. Yeah, it comes all the way from the main road is just there. There's a main road over there. And there's electricity here. So I wanted to tap from here to my place, but it was going to be very expensive going by that. So I just decided to just switch to the solar. So right now he's going to show me. I initially thought this bamboo was going to be where I was going to be cutting from where the stream is, but I'm told that part is not, you know, they don't cut that part because of the stream. Probably that was part of the reason why I felt something creepy over there. So he's going to show me, uh, I think, his wife's farm, which has a lot over there that I can get about 100 pieces, which I'm excited about actually. So I'm going to see that, and then um, from there, uh, maybe I have to come back again because I have to pay some amount of money to get that, and then also to see the the, the elders, just to give them something, you know, small to say hello to them and then tell them that I want part of or some of the bamboo so yeah 
part of the morning walk. I'm, I'm excited. I actually took the walk to towards the side. I didn't know it was going to be like this. I until I actually thought of purchasing the bamboo because I felt what they had over here were not so much. I like the fact that there are there are fowls and goods just walking around over here. I want to be able to create something like this. I my place. Yeah, so wake up in the morning, just go feed them and then go attend to activities. So we just finished our building, so eventually that is going to happen as well. Yeah. Okay, many battery care. In general. So this is the stream, these are the baboos I was talking about, yeah I think the stream is dry, if you are bashi, the sugar cane here as well, oh, very excited about this place, so that's the Place I was talking about the bamboos and there's sugar cane. It looks like this. Oh, yes, well, but we can't come into fetch and just show you. How are you? Good morning, good morning. Oh, okay. 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 Minimum school in your jay. About she meant man, your jay. Aqua, Aqua, oh, okay. Ah, 
Oh, no, 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 Kaji min top here. Okay. <laughs>
Pia hiyo bia neno una kai. Okay. 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 Okay, fia ke ku yem. Mm, okay. Mm, yeah. Eh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Mm. No me da la fine. Okay. Okay. Uh. So, I am done. Uh, we've gone to look at the bamboos and I think I'm going to be able to get some about 100 pieces of them so I'm able to use that for a fence. I actually didn't even plan on going to see bamboos. I was just taking a walk, but it happened that I met the man I was talking about and he led me to see a couple of them and it looks like I'll be able to get a quantity that I want. So uh, it's nine o'clock already. So I'm heading back to the house, take a shower and then start some work for the day. So maybe some other day I'll go towards the other side and if we are lucky enough we come by the cattle but in case they come by also maybe i'll just film them and then share with you as well so uh i'll be doing more of this see the places around i didn't even know there was a town just close by called aquitaman oh yeah is it aquitaman or aquayman aquayman yeah aquayman instead and there's even a school over there it's like a small community as well with electricity they were jamming to some music so that would be about it for today in case you have any questions anything you'd like to know you can just let me know i think it's even good with regards to the uh, bamboo that is uh, because we've got it to a point on the bigger house that we need some bamboos to support the wood that we'll be using to cast the concrete and if you're going to be able to get some from here for cheap considering the distance as well that would be very very good to go with so i'm really excited about this and yeah let's see how that is going to go so thank you for watching i know this one has been very lengthy of course i'm not going to be cutting part of this out so that would be just about it for now i'll see you in the next one